falling to pieces. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey, I am back. This video, we woke up at 8 a.m. Huh? Where am I? This vlog, I really tried to initiate self care. I treated myself, okay? I treated myself. We got a problem with that? Hopefully not. Anyways, we did some fun stuff and I bring you guys around with me throughout Boston. I walked 25k steps. Towards the end of the video, I did a little mini Q&A for you guys. There's gonna be a giveaway at the end. That's how the video is gonna run. Are we excited? If you're not excited, then what the F? WTF? <laughs> Come on. Be excited. Imagine I insert a clip of me just doing that, but without this effects. That's fucking weird. Oh, let me spit. Let me give a little spit. Hopefully, you guys will like the vlog. If you don't, I'm gonna be sad. Just lie. Just lie. Just be like, I love yeah. it. <laughs> no, no. Be honest. Don't be honest. Don't hurt my feelings like that. Let's get on with the vlog. Oh my god. It is currently 10, 15. Yeah, we took a while. That was mainly the hair that took a while. Today we have a lot on the agenda, okay? First, we have some trash to throw out. Guys, um, I'm fucking hungry. It's currently 11 12. I've been walking for like the past like 20 30 minutes. So I called them and nobody answered at the bakery. So I'm like, what if they don't open? And I just want to go get something to eat. I'm hungry. It's already 11. I haven't ate. I'm hungry and I'm sweating. Like I curled my hair. You can't even tell it's curled. As you guys know, I have this shade, the honesty shade, but I feel like it's too brown on me, so I wanted to get like a pinker shade. I tried Wonder Out, but it was like, I feel it's too, it's the first one. I feel it's too pink. Um, so here's me at Target looking confused as hell because I don't know which one I'm gonna get. And here is me just waiting for the staff member to come over. And don't worry, I already called them. I just, I'm just waiting. I love the music, the music, go off, go off. I got this because I found out that if you put pimple patches on your nose, it gets rid of things. So I decided to get like a big, big one. Let's see how this works. I like this color, strawberry red. It's between these two. Oh wait, right, these two, these two right. Should do it. We are almost at the cafe. Hopefully it is open. If it's not, I am literally going to cry. It says closed, you see that? Oh, I'm okay. Oh, okay. Oh. It's okay, I was gonna go there, but it's closed. Thursday it's okay. Thursday to Sunday. Huh? Thursday to Sunday. Oh, that one? Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay, thank you. The guy who was doing the construction was really nice because basically the reason why I couldn't get closed was because the roads are blocked. We'll go somewhere else. That was super nice. I'm, I'm happy when random strangers decide to help you out. Wait, the reviews seem pretty good. There were no seats inside. Like there was a seat for you to wait, but there were no seats to actually sit down and write. So I left.
currently at Ritzium. And there's no mirror in the And I'm trying on this top. I thought it was gonna be a flowy top, but no, this is a dress, I think. And it's like cinched in. I'm not going outside looking at the mirror. I thought it was a top. That's why I wanted to try it on. Oh, and plus I like this color too. It's so cute. Oh, I don't like it. I just went to the Sephora in Prudential. They don't have the rare beauty lip oil. It's so freaking hot and humid. I think it's like in the mid 80s right now. It's disgusting. I just went to the Sephora on Newbury and the staff members are so nice. Like, they didn't have Serenity, but then I realized like maybe Serenity is too close to the shade that I have. So I got Wonder, which is a very, very pink, and we will swatch it when we get back. Um, anyways, I purchased my first pair of sunglasses. They were a little expensive, but I was like, you know what? You should invest in a good quality sunglasses. It is like foggy. You see that? You can't see the next building. It's like currently at Trigger Church. Why is so long? We just came back. Oh my god, I'm like sweating. I washed my hands and I got myself some ice water. And next what we're gonna do is I'm gonna mop the ground. Sanitize the phone, I almost forgot about it. I've got one for myself and one for you guys. I wanted to get matching, matching ones, but this was, was the closest one, so I got this one for you guys. Very much for my update. I felt like I should get myself stuff. This is a super, super cute necklace. Should I change it into that? I might. They're, they're, they're the same length, it's just one's a little, one's not stuck in, anyways. Yeah. Okay, I swatched her. Um, This is what she looks like. She's very pink. I love the jewelries. But the thing was that the back of this, it doesn't close all the way. Like, I have to like press on it. treat myself to rice cake for my little celebration but no it says we're closed on Tuesday fuck oh my god what the hell is this to do why is my luck so ass you know what we're not gonna let that ruin our mood we cannot let that ruin our mood I've never been here before we got our food okay <laughs> this is going to be my celebratory is that how you say it dinner <laughs> I was thinking of whether I should get soju, but I was like, no, I don't like the taste of all. I'm really not a fan of cakes. Like, it's like, I wouldn't, like, I would eat it, but it's not like I prefer it. <gasps> Wait, I kind of want garlic sticks. Wait, these look so good. These two are two items that we're going to eat. Should I get you guys one of these? Bitch, I am relaxed. No, I want to get you guys one of these. They're so funny. Wait, well, maybe some of you guys can't have swear words. You leave sparkles oh. everywhere you go. Is this too corny for you guys? You know what? Guess what? I'm, I'm a corny person. I'm going to get you guys this one. Take no shit. Give no fuck. I'm getting you guys one of these. These are funny. It is so packed. I don't know if it's because it's like first week of college maybe. Oh, they have a strawberry one too. I'm gonna decide on whether I should get the ice cream depending on the Uber price. I kind of low-key want to walk home because the weather right now is currently really nice. 
It's only nine dollars. We're getting the ice cream. It's only nine dollars. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why is it nine so long? This is God saying that they they don't want me to get the mochi ice cream. I'm putting it back. My GPS sucks these days. It points me in the wrong direction. Editor Via here. Um, I just noticed there wasn't really a transition to the Q and A. So I'm gonna be the transition. So um, the next clip, we're going into the Q and A. Post on my Instagram story, I asked you guys to send me some questions. So I'm just gonna go over them. Name some countries that you would like to visit. Like on the top of my head that I want to go to are like, like honestly, I would want to visit anywhere. Taiwan, which I've been to, but I wanna go back again. Japan, I've been to, that I wanna go back. I would love to visit Switzerland. Do you plan to have your own family? Like, I'm gonna assume that you're asking me whether like I want to like I don't know, start a family. As of now, no. I have a very hard time visualizing myself getting married because to me that idea of it sounds very restricting. Like having a partner itself is already kind of hard for me to imagine. So like starting a family, like getting pregnant. Having kids. That's too much of a responsibility. When you raise a kid, it's not about raising a kid. You're raising a human being. So I'm like, I don't know if I'm capable of that. How old am I? I am 22. What's your zodiac sign? I'm a Scorpio. What's your MBTI? I'm a INTP. Ooh, what's the best kind of advice you ever received and from whom? I didn't really get these advice from real people around me. I usually just see them online or things that I realized through myself. I mean, I can't list all of the biggest lessons. I'm just gonna list the ones that I can come up with the top of my head. One, do it scared. There's never a right moment to do something. You just do it scared. You call the shots. I had a phase where I was like blaming on people being like, oh, oh I'm not doing this because of dumb. Like I'm scared they're gonna say this. I'm scared I'm not saying that. At the end, it was only for me to blame. Like, yes, your environment matters, right? To how you want to do things. At the end, you are the one living your life. At the end, you need to make the call. If you don't make the call and you're constantly sitting there being blaming this, blaming that, nothing's gonna change. And sometimes changing is very hard. You need to do it, you need to try. And that can be very difficult, but you you have to take the first step. Sometimes when you want to start something, you don't need to be perfect when you start. You can be shitty. The most important thing is to start. And that, I, I, I know that sounds easy, but that can be very hard. It's, it takes a lot mentally. If you could talk to your child version of yourself, what would you say to her? I would tell her that, you need to go for what you want. Don't care about what the adults think. Don't care about impressing them, making them happy. Don't, that does not matter. It does not matter because this is your life. You can keep on impressing them and you can keep on doing these things, but at the end, you don't like it. You don't fucking like it. Do the things, even though it feels wrong, even though it feels like I can't do this, this is gonna make them upset. So be it, so fucking be it because sometimes in life you have to be a little selfish. Ooh, what is your favorite flower? This might seem unnecessary to some, but I feel like it's a beautiful thing to know. Mm, good question. I hate to admit this, but I don't know that many flowers. Out of the flowers I know, which is not that many, I like baby breath. I don't like the scent of it, but I like how it looks. My favorite scent of flowers is jasmine flower. How are you so comfortable to be alone? I think I've always been comfortable doing stuff by myself. A big portion of my childhood, I was in the restaurant, so I didn't have many friends my age. But of course I felt lonely, but I know how to cope with it. How can you be so open on your YouTube channel? I think I've done that ever since I was younger. Like I used to post on my Snapchat stories and it's mainly because I had nothing to lose, to be honest. Like it's not like, oh, if I post this, some people won't be my friends because I don't have friends and I just want people to hear me and I just wanted to make friends because I didn't have any friends. It was kind of like just speaking into, not the, this kind of sounds sad, not like the void, kind of just speaking to myself in a way, like when I film in a way. Yeah, I think that was it. Like I was just always by myself. I, I'm, I'm pretty good at speaking to myself. Translated onto speaking to my camera and I'm just very comfortable doing that because I've always done that. Oh, okay, that sounds kind of sad, but it's something like not that sad. Ooh, I like this question. Are you caught up on One Piece? Okay, right ahead in the manga. Oh my God. Lord, did you guys see the Netflix One Piece live action? That shit was so good. This portion of the QA is getting a little long and I see that I have a lot more questions. If you guys want a dedicated YouTube video of like me doing a Q&A. I'm just gonna show you the items that I want to be giving away to you guys. That was a while ago, I think I got it from China. Um, basically you can flip it and wear it. These are gold planets, they're earrings. Yeah, I wanna give it to you guys as well. A Boston card, I wanna give it to you guys because I'm from Boston, yeah. Got these today as well. These are just like little hair clips. You can probably clip, clip your hair or something. These are just socks, take no shits, give no fucks. 
And I got you guys these. Um, this is a little pouch that you can just put stuff in. I have one myself. Here are so just some cute stickers that I got that I thought you guys might like to decorate your journals with. Like, I think these are posted. I just thought they were cute. Okay, I actually don't know what this is. These are pens in different colors. I think you guys can probably figure it out, but they're pens. I'm pretty sure these are pens. You know, you got a journal with a pen. I got you guys post-its as well. Here's another pen. And then I got you guys a highlighter. I saw this one necklace that was kind of cute, so I just got it for you guys. Bracelet that was kind of cute. I never really used washi tape. I thought these washi tape were cute. Very, very cute. Yeah, look at that. That's so beautiful. And it's, it's summer. Um, my favorite season is not summer. I don't like summer, but I just thought it was kind of cute. Little cherry. That's it for the giveaway. I am going to be only selecting one winner this time. I want to give it to one person and this one person can also give it to their friends because I think that's something that's very sweet. And of course you can keep it for yourself. That's totally fine. But it is a lot of items. So like if you're like, oh my god, like I want to give it to some of my friends or some people that I know or my siblings or whoever, do it. And maybe that can create a stronger bond between you guys. I don't know. Uh, this is going to be only within the US. Um, for my last giveaway, I shipped out of the US. Um, the shipping fee was a... Uh, I did not expect the shipping fee to be ex extremely high. I think the cost of the shipping was higher than the overall giveaway items, which was insane to me. As of now, at the moment, I cannot ship internationally. I'm very, very sorry. Very expensive one for me to cover. So if you would like to enter... First of all, this is going to be for my YouTube subscribers. So of course, you have to be subscribed. This is a given. Be subscribed. And second of all, just comment a uh, tulip. And if possible, also leave your IG username in the comments. I realized last time that YouTube deleted comments. I think it doesn't allow you to leave your email addresses. So um, just leave me something other social media platforms that I can reach out to you. 24 hours and hopefully you'll respond. If not, I would have to move on to the next participant. So the deadline to enter would be uh, September 15th. Yeah, I just want to say that um, honestly did not think this was going to happen. Um, I didn't think that there'll be so many of you guys and I am very, very grateful. And I get a lot of comments where people are like, oh my god, you blew up so fast. Like the videos I made before, it they're, they're, not many people watch them. And I've been making them for months, basically. And honestly, during that time period, I'm like, oh, I don't think anybody is really gonna ever watch my videos, to be honest. Yeah, and it's just, it's just nice to be able to connect and see that so many of you guys relate to a lot of things I talk about. I just wanna thank you guys for always being so supportive of me and um <laughs> dealing with me honestly like i just, sometimes i just post like the most randomest shit and you guys you know just always like hype me up and you just don't really judge me and like you know just let me do my own thing this little community we're building being kind is very very important be kind be nice don't be mean unless you have to be mean unless some 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 bitch is coming for you then yeah be mean we'll all die someday you know, we'll all be gone from this earth someday, so just be nice while we're at it, right? I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I had a lot of fun making it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. And I will see you guys all very, very soon. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, morning, afternoon, or night, wherever you are. I love you guys. I'll see you guys very soon. Bye!